Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. We had us uh, some thunderstorms last night. I think Diana slept through them. I didn't. I, I do not have that ability. The storm was mild compared to what it would have been out in the Midwest, and I'm going to have to mentally prepare myself for that since we have a pending trip to Iowa to surprise my dad for his 70th birthday. Diana and I are going to be spending a few days there. This vlog won't be uploaded until after we've surprised him tomorrow. Later today, Diana says we have to drive up north to go to my birthday present, or at least one of my birthday presents. I have no idea what it's going to be. Maybe the road trip is the present, you know, because they say it's not the destination, it's the journey. Not sure if I'm really up for a road trip today, but it is what it is. It will be what it will be, and by the end of this vlog, we'll all know what happens. She says that in order to make it on time, we have to leave here at 4 p.m., and we're probably going to be wherever we are until late, which is going to be a challenge, because tomorrow morning, we have to be at the airport at 6 a.m., which means we'll have to leave our house by 3.30 a.m. tomorrow, not today. If you think you're confused by my schedule, imagine me. Sorry, hun, had to mute it. We don't have the rights to rebroadcast the music. Your what? Your phone's ringing. It is? It is! Well, it's bright. I know some people put music into their YouTube videos, but sometimes they get in trouble and then the videos get taken down, and I don't want that to happen to any of our videos. As much as I enjoy music, no one's ever really gonna know what I'm listening to. Yeah. Or you, either, Missy. What? It's my nipple. It, it flashes. <laughs> I have flashing nipples. You know what I'm obsessed over right now? A few things? The new Miley Cyrus song. Okay. This conversation's over. Damn you, autocomplete. Yesterday I keyed in upstairs omelet when I meant to say upstairs complete, not omelet. They did not make that. And Diana thought I was talking about something else. Yes, I thought you were making up big words. I read it as omelette which I thought it meant semi-complete. <laughs> That's pretty good though, right? You know, we could probably get that in Urban Dictionary now. <laughs> Amelite now means semi-complete. Yeah, because you always use big words. You just throw them in there. How else were you going to find out? Say a big word right now. What? Let's have a word of the day. I think we have the word of the day, omelette. Oh yeah, omelette. I have to jam through a few things this morning, including a second sponsored video for Hover.com. If you didn't catch that in the YouTube channel, you can save 10% on a domain name registration by using the coupon code LockerGnome. And everyone seemed to like the first one I did. I registered where to get goodcoffee.com, and today I believe I'm going to register GiveMeTheBacon.com. Diana and I are starting a new skills training course. Thing. <laughs> what would you call it exactly? It's not a class. It's like personal sessions to help us be better people. People are not in marriage counseling. We're not in marriage counseling. <laughs> We're not. It's not marriage counseling. To tell them. Well, I think you realize when she said that you would think that we're in marriage counseling. We're, we're, that's not where we're going. See, would you do that if you're going to marriage counseling? You know, we should start a marriage counseling, like, <gasps> yeah. thing. And, and, and the I'm whole... learning to eat better. Have you eaten today? That's not better. But I did have a piece of pretzel. Oh, well, that's a start. And what are you learning? I'm learning you, you that... You already eat well. Yeah, I eat too well. <laughs> That's my problem. We need to, like, find a balance. You eat more, I'll eat less. No, I need to eat more healthy. Yeah, no, I agree. Starting with, you know, one pretzel bite. Mm -hmm. And a pop to go. You know, I think our course would include you have to vlog your life and upload it to YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> he has a funny hat. And he has a funny hat. I hope he doesn't ever watch this. <laughs> he might. She said you have a funny hat. But she likes it. She likes guys with funny hats. I, I want one. You 
You should get one. I don't, I don't want that hat, though. I want my hat. You forgot your wedding ring at home again, didn't you? I did. I forgot both. You're not proud of this marriage, are you? <laughs> I don't even have my earrings on. What do I do? Can I borrow yours? So you look like the bad guy? Diana's funny. She heard Pixie last night, but not the thunderstorm. You took your key. Well, of course I took my key. Where's my key? I don't know where your key is. Where's my spare your key? Your spare my key. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Well, can I borrow your key then? Do I get it back? Maybe. We're all jumping on you. <laughs> Bye! I'm starting to get nervous. Diana hasn't told me anything about what we're doing tonight. But I know we have to drive a long way. Did she tell you what she's doing? Do you know where we're going tonight? You do. I can see it in your eyes. You're ashamed. You should be ashamed. Tell your daddy. He'll give you a treat. Can you give me a hint other than it's up north? No. Do I have to put on makeup too? Is it one of these kind of things? Mm-hmm. You could. I, I could, but should I? Am I dressed appropriately? Yes. Yeah, I can't get into the car, honey. You drove it, and it was nice for you to get the gas and everything, but you pulled in a little too close to the recycling bin. There's one rule to me driving. I get to listen to whatever music I want. Ah, oh, come on! That's not even fair! This is a gift for me! She had to think about it for a second. I'm sure we're still going to be listening to her music. She made me stand outside the vehicle while she plugged it into the GPS. The only thing I know is that we're driving somewhere. Are we there yet? <laughs> no. What are you going to do with all this time? Passenger. Is it bigger than a bread box? A red box? Bread box. Oh. Yes. Is it red? Jungle gym. No, that would be cool. No. <laughs> Watch the road. You're scaring me. Could be in a passenger. What'd you call him? Driver. A passenger driver? Yeah. Backseat driver? Yeah. You know I'm sitting in the front seat now, don't you? <laughs> Watch the road. I'm a horrible passenger. I am. I'm like my dad. I'm, I'm like tapping the invisible brake. <laughs> okay, so we hang. Oh, that's the wrong foot. I'm a horrible passenger driver, backseat, front guy. This is gonna be stupid, isn't it? Arrested Development reference. This is stupid. It's stupid. Now this is stupid. He's not going to the same place we are, is he? He might be. Party time! Excellent! Have you ever done this before? They need to keep you entertained. Well, I'm still <laughs> curious as to what we're doing, because so far this is not fun. No, I've never done this before. At all? At all. In my whole life. Have you done anything like it? Somewhat. 
Is this something that I said I wanted? One day you did. I did? Well, maybe you didn't, but... So maybe I did and maybe I didn't. But, ah! Uh, ah! Uh, am I in the right lane? I hope so. Only you know where you're going. <laughs> I think so. And now, The Journey, starring Bird Poop. We are getting further and further away from civilization. <laughs> I, mean, I don't mind the views. Trees are nice, it's just we have trees at home. Yes, we're almost there. About 10 minutes. I don't want to deny them the beauty of this trip. kind of at our destination now, but I don't see anything that's jumping out. Do we have to go in? Yes. You should be seeing a lot of people. Ew, a lot of people? But you'll like it. Did you like throw like a surprise? Oh, honey, it's green. Oh, what? The light there. Sorry. <laughs> I was going to ask if you threw like a surprise something up here, which is kind of a remote destination that I don't think anybody would journey to. It's a lot of cute little shops. We came here to go shopping with a lot of people? <laughs> this deal is getting worse all the time. Okay, this next street. We'll be taking a right. You bought me a street. <gasps> da -da -ding. Ding -ding. Oh, and it turns red. There's some clues up there. There's some clues up there? Leaves. That's... <laughs> Scared. Kind of, yes. Okay, here we go. Where do I park? Baby, I don't know where we're going. How do I know where you're going to park? You're green, though. Oh, yes, we, we know. <laughs> She's aware it's green. <laughs> I already informed her, it's okay. And then, your destination is ahead on the right. Like slight left? Slight left is there, and the destination is on the right. Mount Baker. And a lot of people getting dropped off. Right here. Yeah. Right here. So this is yeah. Mount, Mount Baker. Yeah. This is what? So I guess we a park theater. Ball! <gasps> you have arrived at your destination. The route guidance is now. Are you, are you kidding me? A Weird Al concert? Yeah. Oh no way! Oh, I haven't been to one in over a decade. Are you kidding? You got me tickets to a Weird Al concert for my 40th birthday. It's this is awesome! Ah, are you kidding? Are you kidding? No! <laughs> oh. oh, dude, this is the best 40th gift ever. Good job! That's a really... Are you going to come see him with me then? I'll wait here. I'm just kidding. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't know. I mean, like... you. you might have wanted to go down the block to get some Froyo. Oh, wow. I'm going to a Weird Al show. <laughs> Did any of you guys know this? Did you tell anybody? No one. Uh, I told your mom. Oh, and we're about an hour early. This yeah. is so good. It's not open yet, right? No, I don't think so. And babe, I, can we park here? Yeah, we, we you got rock star parking too. It says like something about paying. Or yeah, we, we pay to park, but we're like perfect. Right across the street from the theater. Yeah, early. Diana's trying to verify the position of the seats. I asked, I didn't know. As long as I can see the stage somehow, I'll, I'll be happy. Even though I always have a difficulty seeing anything on the stage because my sight is so poor. Because we didn't get like right up front. It's okay, it's okay. We're here at the show and I'm very happy. I'm really nervous and I don't know what to expect. But I'm glad Chris is very happy about this surprise. And I hope he has a good time. We got a little bit of everything plate. Cheese and fruits and cured meats. And I'm waiting on my salad. I think I'm going to stick to this. 
You know, the first concert I ever went to was Weird Al. Really? Yeah, I was a college kid. Went there with Eric Mishka, an old friend and roommate. I should let him know. Oh, dude, he'll oh, freak he's out. Shit. He's one of the very few friends that I've grown up with that I wanted to stay in touch with, at least on Facebook. You know, I've never been to a concert. This is my first one. Shut up! Yeah. Dude, okay, this is a total bonding experience then, because Weird Al was my first concert. Weird Al is now your first concert. Mm -hmm. It's our first concert together. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Weird Al. You excited? Yes. Me too. Very excited. Best gift ever. I've had a lot of gifts in my life, you know, being 40 years old. Yeah. This one tops it. Really? Oh, yeah. You beat C-3PO. No, I beat my own gift? Yes. The golden C-3PO Lego minifig that I opened up. You beat that. Oh. Good job. How was it? It was awesome. I think it was the best oh, like ever. Pictures. Well, you don't have anything to compare it against. Right. But it was a lot of fun. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. I err on that side. And now we're in line to hopefully get an autograph. Yes, and I don't know if we're going to be able to get him into the vlog. Get him to autograph our tickets, maybe? Yeah. Okay. Hopefully it's out fun. Weird Al remembered me and was very happy to hear that this was Diana's first concert ever. <laughs> yeah. It was just nice to be remembered by Al. Yeah, he right. I mean, you haven't changed a bit, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, like, he knew, he knew. <laughs> That's so cool when your idol, you know, yeah. remembers you or knows you. Now I know what it feels like, you know, when people meet me in real life, yeah. you know, they're like, ah. It's exciting. <laughs> it's That's really so exciting. Much fun. I didn't have a chance to ask Al if he wanted to be in our vlog. Unfortunately, they were kind of moving us through the line quickly, but we did get pictures with Al. Here's mine, and we'll post the full one on uh, our, our, I guess, our social feeds. There's Diana's. Oh, I look, I look weird. Back in the day, I used to have a Weird Al fan site. I don't know if people still have fan sites these days, but that's how I got to meet John Bermuda Schwartz, who is still the webmaster or operator of WeirdAl.com, and, and I'm hanging out with him again backstage at, well, not really stage, back lot in the Weird Al concert. Hey, John. Hello. And that was John. And now we have a two-hour drive home. Diana's hungry. I'm a little peckish myself. I want hot Cheetos. Problem is, it's 11 at night. Get home about 1 in the morning. Take off at 3. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to be able to sleep. You can't sleep on the plane. Yeah, I can't do that either. I can. You're lucky. I'm going to be like... Wish I could do that right now. <gasps> well, do you want me to drive and you sleep? No, 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 no. I won't be able to sleep in the car either. Oh. You're driving kind of... You had a good time tonight? I had a blast. That's legit, too. I, I really, she kept laughing the whole time. It was awesome. She really like, enjoyed herself. Like, just when you think it can't get any better, it's like he comes out in a peacock suit. <laughs> Made it home. Safely. Oh. Ugh. Not much traffic, though, coming back. In a couple more hours, we'll be heading out, so I don't think I'm going to be sleeping, but I do believe that this vlog has just about come to an end. Thanks again for liking, commenting, and sharing all our videos.